Hey everybody, Cypherboy here. Today's video is going to be about organizing your YouTube videos. It's a different video from what I normally do, which is mostly gaming. Um, so here you see what I started out with. This is the first thing I tried. And spoiler alert, I did figure out something different, so stay tuned if you want to see what I did. As I said, this one is what I first came up with, it's just a notepad, um, episode name, uh, intro that's for the little timestamp thing, and then the rest of it's edits and notes. So I thought this looked um, messy, so I went ahead and tried something else but first I'm going to show you this program so this is the Zim wiki I've been using it since maybe 2007 or 2008 and it's pretty good for having your own kind of like Wikipedia but it's a uh, it's something you can use on its own without having the internet so you can create what's called uh, notebooks and then just have whatever it is you need I'll leave this for um, for you guys in the description box below along with the pinned comments so this is the free thing you can contribute some money if you want to donate to them but I decided to use my Scrivener page um, Scrivener app I mean so this is what it looks like at first whenever I uh, switched it over to this which I didn't like the look of it still so I went ahead and went to the templates and created this type uh, I was gonna say timetable but it's just a table uh, video title intro scene timestamp timestamps for the 2021 YouTube Rewind which I do plan to do this year and edits to be made so not only that I did create the music template to replace whatever is in the game since we cannot use copyrighted material so uh, I did this thing and the pretty cool thing is let me go ahead and delete that that one so after you have a template folder you can choose one of these other folders and do like that and then uh, like that so you can import a copy of it into whatever folder which saves a whole ton of time so you don't have to keep doing the same thing over and over and um, here I'll show you, let's close these out, like from here you can do a split screen and then you can see the two comparisons here which is this is the old one, this is the new one and I think this one looks a lot cleaner than this one does. Yeah so far I've got 12 episodes. So. I did the Zim Wiki first because that one's free, but this one you have to pay between I think forty and fifty dollars for the license to use this program. <laughs> so I have two cost comparison for you. Um, I use this. I'll um, also leave the Scrivener thing down below. And so I hope you enjoyed the video. It's a pretty short one, I think, so hope you got some good ideas. I'll probably make maybe more templates. I don't know for sure, though. Um, I would think about it. Anyways, hope you enjoyed, and with that saying, I'll see you later. Bye.